Hey, how you doing? Nick from Bighorn Golfer here, the electric push cart guy. If you like our videos on our electric push carts, golf simulators, and other videos, please make sure you like and subscribe. We'd really appreciate that. Today we have something really awesome. It's an electric push cart. It's the Cam Caddy B1, the best bang for your buck in the electric push cart industry. It comes in at $699.99. It is a terrific price. It's, like I said, it's a motorized cart, so you don't have to carry your bag around anymore. You can freely walk 18 holes. If you're not able to do that now, this will help you. Instead of pushing that big heavy bag around, I'm telling you, this will most likely allow you to walk 18 holes again. It'll be a great feeling. So let me show you how this, it's, it's so convenient, so simple when you unload your cart into the car. So you simply fold that up, lock it in place. That's probably not where I want it, but that's okay. Fold that up, lock that. Now we can set this where I want it for my height. I generally like to you know, keep it around waist height. That's where I want the handlebars. So these are obviously adjustable. The strap is adjustable for the bag. Same down here. This will fit a big cart bag like I have myself. I'll show you here in a minute. Here's the battery. Very easy to take out. Push this button, grab it with this hand, pull it right out. The charging port is right here. So you can take this out what I would do is take it out before you fold it up and put it in your trunk. And then you can take it in your garage or in your house and charge it. That way it's ready to go for the next time you play. Then to put the battery back in, that's all there is to it. Comes with an umbrella holder. So you unscrew that, screw that back in, put it in place, get it vertical. And then there's a set screw here where you can put your umbrella down. It comes with a cup holder. Here's the cup holder. It's nice, it'll fit something nice and big. Uh, it'll fit a whole bunch of different sizes because it's expandable. It comes with a wheelie bar. So if you do have a tiny trunk, this is convenient. You just press this button and you can actually make this smaller. If I press this button and you can remove this. And then same thing to put it back in. It's very easy. There's two nice storage compartments. One bigger one right here and a smaller one right here. You can put a bunch of different things in here. You can throw your wallet and different things right here, which is, is super convenient. Okay, so I got my bag here. After you get the cart unloaded from your car or truck, you have it fully opened, ready to go. You put your bag on, you make sure these are fully open. I have a large cart bag. Uh, it's the Sun Mountain C-130, so it's big, it's heavy. The heaviness doesn't bother me anymore now that I, that I have electric push carts um, because it does all the work for you. You don't have to carry the bag or you don't have to push that cart around all 18 holes because in Western Pennsylvania here, we do have some very hilly courses um, and this is a lifesaver. It's, it's a breeze to walk 18 holes. There's nothing to it. So here's my bag, it's camo. Obviously right now I would like to take a moment to thank all the men and women out there who have bravely served our country. So thank you veterans. We appreciate your service here at Bighorn Golfer. You take that there, set it right on there, nothing to it. Strap that around, grab a hold of the handle, put it right in there. Do the same thing up top here. Now you can see my towel, both my towels and my clubs are extremely filthy. Here in Western Pennsylvania, it's March and the courses are basically a swamp right now. So everything's dirty, so I apologize about that. So here, Right here we have, um, you, can, you can hang a bunch of different things here. If you got anything to hang on there, towel, whatever. I just wanted to kind of illustrate that that's there. So it's a convenient place for you to put your towel. Um, you can hang it there. Here's the cup holder. So this is a, this is a nice um, Yeti style cup. It fits perfectly in there. These are expandable, so it'll fit a bunch of different sizes of cups. Obviously drink whatever is best for you for your swing juice. So sometimes it's water, sometimes it's beer, usually icy light. Okay, and what's really nice about this cart is the front wheel will swivel 360 degrees. So as you got a hold of the handlebar, 
it'll turn really nice and easy. And obviously this is the umbrella holder. So if it does happen to rain, it's fine. You can use the cart. Um, now you cannot put the cart in a pond, obviously. Uh, it won't work after that. So do, do know that if you get caught in a rainstorm, it's okay, you know, just take it back, get everything dried off. Um, just try not to get it fully entrenched in water. Okay, let's take a look at how the cart operates. So what you need to do, once you get your clubs loaded up, everything on here ready to go to head to the first tee, you simply press and hold this button right here on top. That'll turn the cart on. So you can see right now, it's in park. That shows how much battery is left. So there's a nice illuminated battery gauge there for us. And that shows us what gear it's in. So one would be the slowest gear. Turn it to the right clockwise. That would put it in second, third, fourth, and finally fifth. Fifth is pretty fast. So what you would want to do is you would start, start at one when you first get this and see if that's the speed you would want to walk at. It's likely a little bit too slow. So you'd probably want to bump it up to two or possibly even three. But what you do is you power the unit on like this and to start the cart to activate the motion, you just press that button and it puts it in drive mode and then you can stop it. So again, I'll show you again. It's as simple as I'll turn it off and turn it back on for you. You get your clubs loaded up, ready to go. Power on, already in first gear. Press it, and it's ready to go. It's a great cart. It also comes with this remote. So there's a speed button, plus and minus here, and start and stop. You cannot control direction with this remote. You can only start and stop the the cart so that's all you can do with it so when you get back to your truck your car let's do the reverse let's take it off so you grab a hold of the handle here on the strap undo that same on the bottom take the bag off make sure this is powered off i still had it powered on so you do the same thing you just press and hold that and it shuts that off. Now what you'll probably want to do, just so you don't have to do it when you get home, you can be one step ahead. Let's go ahead and take the battery out, press this button, grab this with the other hand, take this out, and you can set it in the vehicle so you can charge it. Obviously want to take your cup out. First thing you can do is unlatch that, and then unlatch that. Do that in either order, whichever's best for you. You're ready to go, ready to put it in your trunk very light. Like I said, best bang for your buck in the electric push cart industry. We here at Bighorn Golfer believes in this cart. We've used it a whole bunch of times. We love it. So if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. We'll be here to help. Thank you.